Hello, welcome to episode 6, first racing episode of our Black Spoke Pro Cycling Academy career. So today we have, so we've actually come up to the Tour de Before we start, let's have a look at some of the mail we've got. So wild card of the Tour de France, we are World Tour, we already get invited. This is a good example of why I reduced the number of teams in the World Tour. See, so look, 12 teams are requested invitations, 8 teams will receive wildcards. So we've got AGR, BNB, Bengal, CCC, Circus, Cofidis, Israel, Nippo, NTT, Arkea, Sunweb, and Hotel Direct Energy. So hopefully there'll be some more pro continental teams in there. We've also got the a few of our riders, their training style changed. So what we did is we went into the here and we changed their trainer over. Uh, same thing again, Perinese, 13 teams requested this time, and 9 teams will receive a wild card. You would like to note that Team CCC did not request, and neither did NTT. So there's more places for some of those pro-continental teams. So we can delete that mail now, head over to the results page, anything major happen, NZ Cycle Classic, Visconti's winning, as a Conti team. Otherwise, let's get into the Tour de Nanda. So what I did do is actually, when we're off camera, is we got a planner. I spent a good few hours planning all the races up till the Giro. Yes, I know I stuffed up. I clicked confirm schedule for the first four months before actually looking at the schedule. And there are too many races. Which actually made it annoying because a lot of riders are just I had to keep changing their tiredness. I've also planned the riders for the for the Grand Tours based on the objectives, which means we will not be doing at the moment what we wanted to do, which was a in in the Giro every person have a national champion jersey. It's just a bit unlucky like that. Could have done it, but whatever. So let's get into this race, the Tour Down Under, Stage 1. As it loads, we will look up the 2020 Tour Down Under results. For these stages must be the same route as it was. So remembering Richie Port won overall. First stage was won by none other than Sam Bennett from our team. However, we're not bringing Sam Bennett with us to the Tour de Under. He was not in the right fitness for the Tour de Under. So instead, we have Matteo Trentin. Top 10 from stage 1 was Bennett, Philipson, Busker, Viviani, Greipel, Halverson, Ewan. Sorrell, Wellsford, and Dainese. So let's have a look at our team we have. Is a well, these national champ jerseys are really nice. Which I still haven't made for our team. Uh, pause it as we look at the riders who are starting. So we've got number 71 with Patrick Bevan. Philip Gilbert, John Dakencole, Caleb Ewan, Carapraz, Dennis, <laughs> Kwiatkowski, Valverde, there's no one really, Jakobsen maybe, yes, Runewegen, Kreisvag, Turnison, this is going to be a tough race, Christoph, there's Ackerman, there's Baska, oh jeez. Michael Woods, David Galdu, Izzy Gira, Luchenko, Cobrelli, Moschetti, Barbea, Haga for some reason. Surely it's like Chris Hamilton or Jai Henley. Uh, Nasser Buhani's here. Bohang, uh, Mizru, Groves, and Hiver. Hiver. So what will we be doing today? We will be protecting. Have a look, Patrick Bevan is 77 today on form, and so we'll be protecting both Bevan and Trentin. 
as both our GC leaders. Probably try and put you in the break actually. Got Rumak in the break. Scully, you can protect Bivin. Are they letting us go? Yes, they are. Cool. Hanging on for dear life in our Croatian national champion jersey. Who else up the road? Seberg, Newlands, Rosetto, Scotson, who's kind of behind, Ian Garrison, and Sam Bewley. Oh, Sabatini's he's trying to get in the breakaway too. He's just attacking, then not, then attacking. What is up with it, this copious rider? Ah, oh, I see. Four riders attacking here. Haga and Russo. There's too many red teams. There you go, come on, people. Let's get a breakaway. Don't let these guys catch up. Ole, is Oliveira are they pacing or are they attacking? And who for? Haga? Looks like they're pacing. Bewley and Garrison are not quite on yet. Come on, do not catch us back up. I want to try and get the mountain of Jersey with the back. We're trying to buzz it over our only competition. Yeah, the bunch is sitting up now again. Cool, let's fast forward that a bit. Who's going to be our main domestic? It's kind of a flat stage. We might use Warren Bargill to be a bit of a domestic here. Oh, he's caught pacing at the front too hard because. Reduced it, so so that down to go up the hills. We do not want to get dropped from here. Let's grab a bottle now. Send Bargill to get a bottle. There we go. Everyone's in red. Why is we're looking good? Bring that pace back up. Slow down to seventy. The hill. Why is everyone pacing so hard? Keep our turns going, 7k's to go. Yes, yeah, so it's going to go uphill and then it's going to go downhill. We're going to sprint for these mountain points. Get the mountain jersey. Then we're going to use Trentine and Bevan for the points classification. There's the bunch there. Apparently, two minutes, but it does not really look like it. It's a tech now, actually. Let's try and get a bit of a gap down, down this hill. We lost a lot of energy. We lost a lot of energy. A little counter attack by Scotson. Sinner's wheel. Losing a bit of energy, but not enough. Let's go around him. Do our own little attack now. Rosetto is the only one that's following. It's pace now. Nope, it's attack again. Come on, come on. No, 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 Damn it. Damn it. Let's have a look at the peloton. Scully is losing a bit of energy up the hill, but otherwise, not too much. Scotland has been dropped. Rumac goes to water. And we'll just race through the stage race. Bugiel goes to water for us. I suppose Bugiel would probably be our leader overall. And they're about sprinting. Come on, get third, get third, get third. I need to pay more attention to the road, not to talking. Or else we're going to lose in situations like that. We have to pace slightly to 63, I suppose. 
in case to go to the next sprint thing. I'm going 65, the peloton's right there behind us. There we go. Four kilometers to the next sprint. I mean, we're second on the mountain classification. So we can put you in the breakaway maybe tomorrow. Get some more. I will launch early. And look at that. If we launched early last time, we would have won it. Great. Now we have some water now over here. I did not mean to automatic it. Who's driving the pace? Mitch Docker. Stop out of the cycle with the mustache. I wonder who he is. Who he F is running for? It would be Uran, would it? Nope, Michael Woods. Okay. There's not much point in doing anything to attack because it's a long flat and we've only got a minute on them now. Astana for Lopez. Nope, is he Gira? Warrell, Divrez, Gidic, Gruzdev, Lutschenko, Martinelli. Lutschenko would be a good leader. Is he Gira and Lutschenko kind of co leaders, I suppose? 54 seconds now. We'll send my go back for bottles soon. Send back heel back now. Rosetta attacks. There's no point us going with them, like I said before. Next person attacks. We're just gonna wait for the peloton now. No oh, buggy has been dropped on this last little on this little hill. No buggy will get back up. Ah, oh, it's just a tiny little bunch but there. Okay. Nothing of importance. We will wait for the peloton. There we go. And we will sit in with our team up here. Slightly stretch out, there's Valverde there. Oh, Bora's now laying down the pace. One, what are they doing that for? Looking for Peter Sagan? Nope, Yuri Sagan. Ackerman, that's Ruby. Laying down the pace, ready for a sprint for Ackerman. We'll let's send Rumac back and get some more bottles. With 20 kilometers to go, we will set up our sprint train. It's a bit of a downhill. I do remember in this stage, everyone, all the AI seems to attack. Oh, Chad Hager attacks again. Off the front, who's off the back? Jai Henley and Lucas. Oh, sorry, Chris Hamilton. Everyone's got bottles and we're looking pretty good, so we'll probably start our train with... Mill to death, 71 on him, 72, 73... 69, so you go there then. Uh, Bevan, then Trenton. If we swap these two around, because it's a bit more of a lead out. Okay. Let's start the race. We've got our Sire First National Champion on the front of the peloton. Also driving the pace is Team Yumbo Visma for Dylan Hrunewegen. Our line's there nicely. Okay, so about 11 kilometers to go. We will 99 the pace. Why are you on Fitchwood Worlds? That's a bit inappropriate. There we go. No, we don't know. Uh, we're not 99 it now. There's one arts. And they were just passing them. We'll put energy gel on Warren Bargill. One thing is, we do not want to waste Warren Bargill too early. Put Adele's on the back of the train, he can recover some energy. Energy gel on Martinez, who's on our wheel. Hansen, Willens, Dehent, Willen, 7k is to go. Martinez is launching. Bargill sits in in front, same thing as before. We'll get him on that. Rubak, energy gel on you. Looks like we're timing it 
pretty reasonably. And we can go to the back now, come around the outside. Martinez, get on the back. Energy gel on Scully. Energy gel on the final two now, and we can launch for Scully. We can launch with these other guys at the back. Okay, get block. Bevan can launch now. 1.2, Trenton can launch because this is a weird corner. Trenton got blocked. Oh, no, 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 no. Trenton's got too much energy. Trunavagan takes in front of Ewan, Moscheto, Buhani, and Jakobsen. We come home in 6th place. Bevan finishing in 12th. Scully with it be 14th. Uh, Lumac in 16th. And Bakil in 20th. So quite a few top 10s. Our lowest rider was, of course, Mil Tiedas. And he came home in 37th. Straight to the results. I don't usually look at the podiums. Trunavagan, Donovan. Not dominates the sprint, so Matteo Trenton. Uh, what's happening in general? We've got the Rumak because there's bonus seconds in fifth, Trenton in tenth, and otherwise, anyone lose time will really badly crash out. Just Rui Oliveira and Miles Scottson. Rui Oliveira looks interesting. We will shortlist him. Uh, third of the team classification. Okay, let's go to the next day. I'll probably do three stages this race, this episode, then another three the next episode. Oh, according to this, the favourites for today's stage are Matteo Trentin and, and Patrick Bevan. Is it because it's a it's slightly uphill, that's why? Uh, Steba. Kill one. Just check the things. Fly race organizers. We can go to Perry Tours, Japan Cup, Tour of the Alps, Mount Von 2, and Tora Taihu Lake. Cool. Let's 3D race this. So we, we probably want to open the bag of our season early. It's going to be another fuel sprinters race. Now remembering since it's uphill finish, we're going to start our leader a bit later, so maybe 9 kilometers to go. If we lose a rider, we'll go 8. What is it Benji Nason says? Benji Nason says, or Nason, he says 1.5 kilometers for every lead out man. So. That's what we're going to do. 1.5 kilometers. In real life, stage 2 was won by Carla Buen. Second was Dale Impey, Nathan Haas, Philipson, Philine, Vendram, Lucin, Sanchez, Ulysses, and then George Bennett. So, apparently the sprinters win it, which I know from the foul. Why is everyone on bad race days? Bevan's on a good race day. Okay. Um, we're gonna put Rumac in the breakaway. Where's Rumac? He's right at the back. Oh, great. Uh, we'll just leave him in the peloton for now then. Um, we will get Rumac to protect Trenton. No, to protect Bevan, he's slightly better. And Milton Das to do Trentin. And we'll just fast forward until something happens. Nothing exciting, just a few attacks that aren't going anywhere. We'll try and take the stage win, and then with the stage win, we will try to win the points classification. And we've got Bugill for the mountain finish when we get there. Who's going to be our domestic today? Scully? Scully. Scully is going to be our little domestic, collecting drug bottles for us. Let's go up the top of this hill. Go Scully. My father actually uh, raced against uh, Tom Scully in a uh, club race, actually, quite a few years ago when he was a youngster. He said he was strong then. He must be. He said he's damn strong now. Yeah. Fun fact. And our Cyprot rider is getting hammered because he can't climb. 
But like I said, the reason I chose him, he was a double national champion. He had road race and time trial. And it's a great jersey to have in the world tour. And he's also being a great domestic. Easily keep again, the Peloton's back together. Bewley's on the attack. Bewley is a great cyclist. If you follow his Instagram, right now during lockdown, he's showing you how to cook. He's showing you how to do lots of things. Let's send Scully to get some more drink bottles. What else is happening in lockdown with others? First, some of you guys may not be aware, the whole of New Zealand is actually under lockdown. So our whole country is confined to our houses unless you're an essential service worker or you're going to the supermarket or to the chemist. Otherwise, you're not allowed of your house. And if you do, the police can imprison you for six months. But other than that, back to the racing, everyone's just... What's happening here? Who's in the breakaway? Rosetto. Bewley and Haga. Otherwise, it's just... Plain old bunch of racing. Chasing them down is... Lars Fabora, Martinelli for Astana, and... Oh, Trenton is punctured. Oh, he's back, he's back. Oh, that was almost a bad time. Nathan Haas and Robert Stanley. Why are you guys sitting up? That doesn't look appropriate. Robert Stanley. Another fun fact about Robert Stanley. He raced under a New Zealand license when he first um, started racing. So he's a Kiwi turned Australian, so New Zealand's kind of like, hey, he's one of us. Um, what else about Stanley? He, I, th I think I raced against Stanley in the junior ranks, I think. At the national champion, junior national champs. I was a useless cyclist, I was at the back. Back then, but. Yeah, I think I did. So I know I definitely raced against Fouché in the uh, junior ranks, but. Standard, not quite sure. Come on, chase him down for us, I don't want to do any work. 20k's to go, I'll bring my train up as normal, and we'll put ones with, with a bad hill on the front. There's going to be Miltadis Scully, even though he's good at sprinting, he's bad at climbing. Okay, let's go now. Um, Scully on the back of that. Put you on like a... Why is it shaking like cobbles? There's no cobbles here. Bargill can go there, Rumac goes there, Bevan, put Martinez, there he's got the slightly best sprint, is he? No, he hasn't. And Trentin on the back of that, cool. Let's get up now the front. It's a bit of a mess here now, Lutschenko's moving up on the left, uh, Asgreen's moving back. So even though, as you guys saw on my schedule, I scheduled in a lot of races, I'll probably only 3D race the major ones, like any World Tour races, and any other ones I think are major. Otherwise, everyone else, we will just... I will either do them off-screen and tell the results, or I will quick simulate them, because I accidentally, like I said, signed up for too many races in the first four first couple of months. Okay, let's get our 99 stuff ready. Or oh, 90, 93 actually, because of the hill. Uh, let's go Scully. You can just go straight back. Going to draw the room mark. 5k to go, 99, let's go, does it pick up a bit more, it does pick up a bit more, Rubak, go now, Scully, get on the back, if you rise at the back, looks like lots of Sudel is coming up, 3k's to go, 99, 99, 99, uh, Martinez, sprint, why not, we'll go early. 
and Bargill sprints. And Bevan and Trenton are losing a lot of energy. Go Bevan. Oh, we've mistimed this completely. Trenton's stuck. If Trenton wanna get stuck. Oh, 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 oh. Yes! You win. You celebrated. You set up. You took the win with Trenton. Bevan third. What an unlucky race. Like we said, we were going to win it there. And if Trenton hadn't got s stuck there, we might have won by a bit more. But stage win for Trenton. Where else our next rider come? Uh, Bargill 15th and Martinez 19th. That's times 8 this. Who's at the back? These two, Stannard and Haas. I don't know why they're so far back. They won't run out of time, but they're way at the back of the race. It's, it's odd. Results. Trenton the quickest. Nope, Trenton just doesn't sit up before the line. <laughs> That's great positioning by our team and a great lead out. Magnus Court and Cobrelli. And overall, Trenton is now second. Woohoo! Ewan's first. Third on points classification. Same again. Same again. And team were actually further down. Because. Skilly did our Cyprot lose time. Our Cyprot did. Our Cyprot lost two minutes and three seconds. That's fine. He's a domestic. That's what he's supposed to do. He's supposed to work hard, then. Just do whatever he wants. Robert Stannard, let's add him to our list. Short list. Okay, so stage three will be the last stage for this episode. I am looking at some software so I can edit the videos to make them a bit better. This one looks a bit more interesting. We'll hell you at the finish. So we will once again protect Bargill. Not Bargill, sorry, uh, Trentine. And we might either, I'm not sure whether we should protect Bargill or Bevan. Stage 3 was one, run, won by Richie Port, then Rob Power, then Yates, Simon that is, Dennis, Ulysses, Impey, ba Van Bala, Geschke, Bennett, and that's George Bennett, and Lucas Hamilton. So it's quite possibly a hill, hill stage. We might put uh, bug you under protection. <laughs> what the daily form is on these riders. <laughs> oh, we're not wearing a jersey. Bugger. Okay. Great. Trainers on negative. Scully's on plus. Bug on nothing. Let's get up to the front here, Bevan's... Hmm. Okay, we're definitely protecting Trentine with our Cyprot and with Bargill. We're going to attack with Trentine actually, right now. 1.8 to the front here, we'll actually attack with Scully, try and get some bonus ducks. Go Scully! <laughs> Don't get, I didn't say get blocked, I said go! <laughs> okay, so we won't get this one, so we'll just effort cursor. Trenton on the back of you, and we'll put the rule mark maybe in the front actually. We'll put Scully behind the rule mark, and then Trenton on the back of him. And we will work for this, these points. Meantime, uh, you can protect Bevan. Where's Trentine? Come on, boy, get up to the front, man, so I can, so we can get some more points in the points classification. Who's it tagging? You, follow. Fine, don't follow. 
Okay, let's go. 93. Might kill you before the hill. No, turnings off the wheel. Who's that? A shot. Go Trenton, go Scully, go well, we're making it up. Oh, Trenton! <gasps> Take Trenton. Right. Alright, now we just sit in and we'll wait for the hill, Angelina Hills to start. Attack, yeah, it's fine, attacking. We've kind of killed Rumak, which isn't ideal, but. Couldn't really be helped in this situation. Who's at the back? Clement Russo. Needs water. Let's send Martinez back. Oh, we should send Scully. Oh, there's been a fall. There's been a fall. There's been a fall. Oh, all of Coffers has gone back to get Viviani. Sam Puli's out back by himself now. And the Rumax is about to die. Come on, people. Times two, nothing more than times two on these hills. It's really going to be a while of pain. Bivin, get up to Scully at the front. Alexander Kristoff has fallen. And he's not starting. Look, he's not going to commence the race. Great. Means in the more sprint stages we have less competition. Oh, well, Cyprot's also losing a bit of energy. Hager's attacked by himself, Hausler's just in between. 80 case to go, Scully and Harper on the front. Chris Harper that is riding for Bridge Lane last year. This tall hook. They should have brought Bevan with him. In the last game to play that I did, they did bring Bevan with them. But it didn't record. Properly. Mm. Damn, Oh, Tom Squidgens has fallen. Is he back with. Is he dragging Bewley back up? Yes, that's good. For Bewley. And then Mitchelton, which would be Yates. Mitchelton, that Groves, Edmondson. They brought a bad team to one of the, to their home race. House lot and Ogden's got in front. Nothing's really changed. It's driving their own pace. Once we get near the end, maybe 20, 30 kilometers to go, we will start pacing at the front, trying to drop some more of these riders. Let's get some water with Martinez, because I know he can climb if he needs to catch back up. Once, he's, once his next domestic dies, I'm going to use Scully. As the next domestic to help us. Fifty k to go. It's just up and down, up and down. Nothing exciting. See, this is when I really need to get some like edit out the bits that are not exciting. Does anyone know of any editing software? I mean, by the time this posts, I probably will be using something. As I schedule these all, oh, get some breaks so we can. Oh, you're gonna die. So I'll just put your automatic now so you can. Why are you putting bug you? Okay. So the game thinks bug you has, has got a chance. I mean, yeah, bug you has a chance. Oh, we'll see what happens. 
two Kiwis, Scully and Bevan, working together. Still 33 Ks to go and Hot Chen Hugger out in front. If anyone's got any suggestions for me, I am open to them about anything. Ways you like want things done, what kind of races you want, all of that. Ways for me to commentate rather than just rambling on. If we weren't in quarantine, I'd think, uh, I'd think about maybe do some vlogs out riding. And our Cyprot is dead now and he's just falling through the back of the bunch. 25 Ks to go, let's use. Uh, we haven't already got anyone yet, so we'll just wait and see what happens. We want to start pacing about there. So the second to last peak. Try and drop some runners, then attack up that last peak. Uh, better get some water. Martinez. Back down to times one. Who's just getting dropped now? Stalkins. Why are they favourites? That's right, the game's like, hey, it's a sprint stage. Bagil, get your ass up to the front, please. Okay, this next downhill, we're going to create, create train. And it's going to be Scully, Rumak, Martinez, Bevan, yeah, so stick you in there, Martinez, there must probably, oh, Martinez is getting water in lol, 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 Bevan, Bagil, Trentine. Big lol. Okay, let's just use Scully up because he's pretty bad right now. Pretty dead. Oh, I think I remember playing this stage actually on multiplayer. And I'm pretty sure the sprinters stayed up and it was a bad time. Yeah. Everyone was complaining how the bunch kept splitting out, but like the likes of Viviani and Ewan were still here. Yeah, Scully's going full pace, even though his full pace isn't much uphill, it's still full pace. Boom, let's go, Rumak. Straight past him, let's go. Scully doing his own thing. Out the back. Six Ks to go, okay. Drive it up with Rumak. Energy Gel on Martinez. Come on, people. Four and a half Ks to go. Still 59 in this bunch. Attack with Martinez, let's go. Rumak, your job is done. Oh, making a small gap, making a small gap. Yes, 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 yes. Energy on everyone. And. Bivin sprint. Buggy will sprint. Trenton sprint. Yes, 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 yes. Ha 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 Is there going to be a, uh, a split? <laughs> First four positions. Oh, I don't think so, because you're caught up to Trenton. Not Trenton, sorry, Tunison. But yeah, like I said, you one kept up. Let's see who else kept up that shouldn't have kept up. Oh, actually, what's you one? No, he's got 59 mountain though. Uh, a lot of Ineos here. Little bikes coming across now. A lot of dead riders. Let's go right to the back, and then we'll fast forward. I think a few riders will be. I'm gonna go our rider. Our Cypro. Oh, he just finished now. Okay. I think a few of our riders will be out of time today. Just a few. Renard, ooh, he's catching up to Cannon Groves. Groves will 
sprint him, Regoves did not sprint him. A few people did run out of time today. That is less than ideal. Let's have a look at the result. Please be a split, please be a split, please be a split. Black spoke pro slightly can be without rivals. Yes, we are, at the moment. Bugger! There's no split! Oh, I mean, like I said, Tunis and Ewan were quite close, but there was there was a gap. And it said 30 seconds when they crossed the line. Okay, who in our team lost time? Skelly lost about three minutes. Now Cyprot, where is he? He lost eight minutes. And who was out of time? Groves, Stenard, and the Renard. But top four place on the stage. That's pretty good. General Trenton's winning the overall, Bevan 4th, Bargill 6th, Romark 7th, Martinez 11th. Still only 20 seconds, so not much. Trenton's in the points club jersey, Mountains, none of us still, Youth, Martinez is 2nd, and Team Classification were 8th. Pretty good effort. We'll just get to the start of Stage 4. And we'll look at a, another episode for stage 4, 5, and 6. Before we do that, we'll look at the mail. Because why not do it now? Wildcard for Toronto. See, look, once again, 13 teams requested, 9 teams will receive. Here are the teams for the tour so AG2R, Total Direct, Arkea, BNB, Cofidis, Nippo, Israel, and CCC. Quite a selection. There's one, two, three, four. One, two, one, two, three. Four. There's four. Um, what do you call it? Um, 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 uh, Pro Conti teams. There's the 14 World Tour teams that will take part. Plus the extra eight. That's pretty good. Compared to what's 14 and 8, it's 22. If we had all 20 World Tour teams, it'd only be two Pro Grunt teams. Cool, so we can delete that. And thanks for joining us in the Santos Tour Down Under. We got two stage wins with Trenton so far We're in the lead. And check back next episode as we go through the rest of the Tour Down Under. Then I'll probably simulate uh, the trophy race. Uh, or do it off camera, race to K. Uh, Tour of Columbia, I might do on camera, but there's really small ones here, probably not. Cheers.